Hey, my name is Phil from LegitMarketingReviews.com and in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing a website security service called WebTotem. And in this WebTotem review, I wanna walk you through exactly what WebTotem is, how it works, and by the end of this video, you should know if WebTotem is right for you. Now, just to let you know, there is a lifetime deal currently going for WebTotem. If you wanna go ahead and check that out, I have left some information in the description, so go there and check it out. So first of all, what is WebTotem? Well, WebTotem, like I mentioned, is a website security service. It offers a plugin if you are a WordPress user where you can directly integrate it or you can install a file into the root directory and it will install from there. I've been personally using WebTotem for about a week now. I had a bad ordeal where I got massively attacked. My entire server and all of my websites got hacked and redirected to spam. So when WebTotem actually came available for lifetime deal, it was the perfect tool at the perfect time. So what I'm actually gonna do right now is jump behind the screen and show you exactly what WebTotem does. Okay, so here we are behind the screen. First of all, we're gonna start off on the Web Totem homepage. I just wanna run through a few things. And then I'm also gonna be showing you the lifetime deal and what it offers because it is quite an amazing deal. So first of all, Web Totem, basically what it does it is a, a website security service that does an in-app firewall. So it helps uh, stop any types of attacks inside your web service. It also is a antivirus, so it scans your website to make sure there's no bad things going on in there. It also is a health board monitor so it's going to tell you what your website's doing and how your um, website is running there's also external monitoring and components guard meaning that it's basically going to scan your website all the time and make sure it works now just to let you know the current pricing you can have one site for ten dollars uh, 15 sites for 30 a month or you can have a custom plan. However, if you use the links in the description, it's going to take you to AppSumo, where there is currently a lifetime deal, and you can actually get 10 websites for just one price of $59, or you can keep scaling. Uh, higher tiers give you more amounts of websites. The great thing about this too, is if you are a service provider, if you're in the web industry, you can actually white label it so the reports come out white labeled, and I'll show you what they look like in a second. So for me, once I actually got attacked last week, the main reason I I purchased this is because there is a malware scan and there's also basic malware removal as well as malware prevention. Um, so that for me was a no brainer. So what I'm gonna do right now is log in and show you what WebTotem looks like. So here we are on my dashboard of WebTotem. Now the first page you're going to get when you actually log in is the overview or the all sites page. And basically it's gonna show you the status of all your websites and how everything is doing. Now on the left we have the site names which may be blanked out for um, privacy. Next we have the firewall and then after that we have the antivirus. Then we've got the service status as well as the technologies the owner which is basically you and then we also have here a drop down which is actions which i'll go through in a second now just to let you know the firewall and the antiviruses columns sometimes they will change to yellow with things like agent unavailable or um, something like that there's there's a few different ones that have popped up for me and i've reached out to support and actually asked them what was going on Basically what they said is sometimes if people are doing a huge sort of scan of their website, it takes up a lot of resources. Um, so sometimes these don't update properly, which is kind of strange in my opinion, but they said, don't worry, rest assured your websites are perfectly protected. Everything is working. It's just the status isn't updated or something something like that. It was a little bit bizarre, but uh, to be honest, the service has worked really well and I'll show you why in a second. Um, so if you see any yellow, if you are using it, don't worry, don't freak out. You're, everything is still working. It's If it goes red, that's when you need to worry. So what I'm gonna do right now is show you legit marketing reviews as website so I can go through the different sort of statuses inside of here. So once you click on it or click on the drop down, it's gonna bring this little uh, sort of section here. Basically what we have is monitoring, your scanning, service resources, firewall, and antivirus. Um, so basically it's just gonna show you an overview of how everything's going. Like for example, the SSL is working, um, the availability as well. It's only been down for less than a second, less than, yeah, 703 milliseconds. The website's been down, so everything work, works well. As well as the reputation, so everything's going well. Um, I won't go over these few uh, resources but I will show you the antivirus to show you how important it is so as you can see it scans all of my website files which is 7430 it's changed 55 of the files because 
during the attack that was on my uh, server 55 files actually got infected with malware so they changed it and then they also deleted 1220 malware files that were additionally added so uh, it has done a massive massive uh, sort of favor for me removing all of this information because there were a lot of people trying to charge me thousands of dollars to remove the malware then hello 59 dollars with AppSumo, and i've got a lifetime license and it's gone ahead and fixed my website absolutely incredible so what i'm going to do right now is actually click on show more to go a little bit more in depth with uh the the back office and the information about uh web totem right so i'm just going to quickly get out of that so that's good so if you come through here it's going to show you all the different types of files you have you've also got here all the um, sections basically the last bits were about but the interesting part is the scoring right so this is where you want to come in here and actually have a look what's going on so as you can see i've got a few issues inside of my website i just wanted to show you these because i'm actually about to go and fix them so what you want to do is just come through here see if there's anything that you can actually fix yourself for example um if there are any things here like security tech I need to go ahead and fix that malware there's no malware which is great SSL is valid so there's nothing really wrong with my website um, but there are a few little things like open ports which I should go ahead and fix if I can fix these two issues here my website should go to an A plus so what you want to do is once you put in your website let it scan the entire website it can take like a day day and a half and then you should come in here and see what needs doing so it's it's very cool next what i'll show you is the reporting column right and the reports are quite interesting so i've actually created a report here um the interesting part about it is you can white label it right so if you want to add in your own logo if you are like using this as a service for your customers you can actually go ahead and upload your logo here and once you get your uh, report you can download it and then you can go ahead and have a look at it so i'll just show you quickly what it looks like so it will have your own logo here so it looks nice and professional and then it's actually got all of this information inside of it. So it's going to show you all the different types of attacks that have been going through. So here is the, um, this is the total amount of checks actually that's been going through. So there's been loads of checks within the website. Um, if I scroll down, I just don't want to show you too much personal information. Um, here we've got, you know, that basic report I've got before as well as some additional information as well as the text information there is the uh the blocks which is going on i'm actually not going to show you the blocks because it's got my personal ip address in here um, but rest assured there is a lot of information inside of here most people to be honest won't even be using this tool um, as it's mainly aimed at agencies next we have documentation inside documentation it's basically just going to tell you about everything how everything works all that sort of good stuff and then finally we have the support now just to let you know i have reached out to support the support is a little bit interesting they don't sign off with their own names or anything like that they just sign off with web, to web totem which isn't exactly bad the live chat is actually really good um, they are quite responsive i only had to wait about a minute before they actually responded so i was very happy with that uh, regardless they are very good they did get back to me within 10 minutes via the live chat like i mentioned it's roughly about a minute and the support was about a few hours max through email right so the last thing i want to show you quickly is the ad site very easy to do so what i'm going to do is click ad site click on um, https put in this website here i'm not going to worry about a tag and then i'm going to go ahead and click ad site now there are a few options to actually adding your website to your web totem um, it's going to take a few moments to load just to let you know basically what it's doing is creating all the resources for that um, website. So as you saw it took like 20 seconds next you want to click on install agent it's going to install the antivirus and the firewall go ahead and click install agent now there are a few options to actually install it to your website i've used the manual one a few times now basically it's going to download a php file and you install it to your root directory of your website um, through file manager or through a cpanel or through however you uh, access it or you can actually do it through the wordpress plugin um, there is also the automatic version where you actually give web totem your um, ftp logins and they will do it for you so either one of those three are very easy to do i'm not actually going to walk you through it because it's a little bit uh going into too much personal information for putting it out there on the internet um, there is a easy step-by-step -step tutorial of doing it once you actually get started though so that's basically it so what i'm going to do right now jump behind the camera once again i just want to talk about a few extra things 
Okay, so that was Web Totem. So as you can see, it is such a simple but powerful addition for your website if you're worried about security. It's gonna help you stay free from malware as well as provide a strong antivirus as well as a strong firewall to keep all of your information safe. Now, if you wanna check out Web Totem, there is a link in the description to the lifetime deal. So I highly recommend checking that out while it's live. But apart from that, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. And if you haven't yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button i've got a lot of new product releases coming out soon as well as launches so make sure you check that out and in the description there is also a bunch of freebies so make sure you check that out too that's it from me guys i hope you've enjoyed the video and i look forward to seeing you on the next one